Hi Libra, welcome to your reading. Thank you for joining me. So, I had a vision of this trickster card in my mind. And so I figured my guides wanted me to use this shamanic medicine deck for our reading, right? On the fourth shuffle, he ended up on the bottom. So I'm like, okay, thank you for reminding me. This reading will be about who's trying to play in your energy at this time with this trickster. Okay? Who's trying to give you um, a, a challenge? It says trickster challenge. I think there's a few people trying to play in your energy, Libra. We have a lot of water energy. And this blows my mind just because of everything that's been happening. The message we received with these first two planet cards, which are Pluto and Neptune. See all that water energy I'm talking about? With Luna at the bottom. And then we have Pisces at the bottom of the Zodiac cards. So Pisces, Cancer with the Moon, Luna. And Scorpio with Pluto. So, yeah. But Libra, this is so important. This message right here, Pluto and Neptune. To start off this reading. Let yourself grieve for those who are suffering. Understand the cycle of life, death, and rebirth as the source of faith and hope. Yeah, my ears are ringing. That was a message for a few special Librans out there that could be grieving or have people around them grieving, okay, at this time. Let's get back to it now. The people that are playing in your energy. Why is because you're receiving a lot of light and love. They see a lot of of light and love around you, your aura could be putting off the sun, woman holding a heart. Your aura could be putting off light and love. So people want to see the other side of the scale. Look what's behind the sun. The Queen of Swords. And wow, behind the Queen of Swords. The Two of Swords. Wow. Counterparts here. This is pretty wild. Behind the Two of Swords is the King of Swords. But the King of Swords is with the Devil card. So that's no bueno. That's no good, Libra. There's a masculine air sign that's in their lower energies. I just heard um, addictions, possibly. And that can be of any kind. I'm not even talking about drugs and alcohol. That can be, um, this is for 18 and up, but SEX addiction, you know what I mean? Things of that nature. But um, the two of swords, it's like people want to see the other side of your scale. They want to bring you off balance, Libra. They want to confuse you. They want you to not be able to see clearly. But I'm hearing, I can see clearly now the rain is gone. Look at that. I can see all obstacles in my way. I don't see any obstacles anymore, Libra. I see you going for it. I see you being successful. I see you being the brightest star in the sky. 
the sun energy. That's why you've got people playing in your energy. All right, we'll start with the tarot. Three more shuffles. Yeah, look at that. I just cut to the page of swords. They're watching. Look at her taking notes. They're reading up, they're researching, they're trying to find anything they can about some of you, Libra. Wow. You give people good ideas. They like to take your ideas. Yep, Empress. Because they see you as being so um, fertile. Anything you touch your hand, anything you put your hands on turns to gold. You could have a successful home life and a successful business life. You know what I mean? Like the Empress, it's like you can do it all. And this puts other people into their feelings, into the Nine of Swords. Look at that. The Empress did not want to leave the bottom. She's like, uh uh uh. Go away, Nine of Swords. Be gone. Look at your water wings, Libra. Your angel wings made of water. I see a full moon here. <gasps> This is reminding me of the approaching full moon. And there will be an, another eclipse. And there will be another eclipse. Okay. Who is trying to play in Libra's energy and why spirit? Who's trying to play in Libra's energy and why the four of pentacles the eight of pentacles your work ethic those that are on the same level as you or you're approaching higher levels Libra right from the four to the eight as you move from the four to the eight of Pentacles you have people that want to take you back and make you feel insecure playing in your energy want to make you feel lack mentality like you have to you can't spend you have to save 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 which it's very good to save and it's very good to be responsible right with your finances but I see you tapped in. Again, something with the eclipse energy, all these moons, money magic, tapping into money manifestation powers. These people trying to play in your energy know you've got it going on. You've figured out something, Libra, how to tap into that money manifestation. Pentacles on pentacles. Four plus eight, that's 12 pentacles, Libra. Yeah, some of people are expecting you to share your pentacles because you have so much, but they need to get their own pentacles. I feel like... People may try to cause towers in your life and you are easily able to just walk away from these situations unscathed with the Knight of Pentacles at the bottom. You don't even have to ride off on the horse. He's leisurely walking with the horse with a trail of money. Something about a money trail. People could be trying to... Count your pockets. Count your pockets. This tower card is about a magical transformation. 
it's like your magical transformation. You've been very steady and steadfast. It may have been a slow transformation. It may have taken you some years to get here, Libra. But look at you. Creating wealth as you go. Spiritual confirmation with the train horns. What is this tower about? The emperor. <laughs> I cannot. Oh, how's the Knight of Pentacles back at the bottom? There's a powerful person that admires your tenacity. Libra masculines, this is you going from that Knight of Pentacles energy into the Emperor. Or you could have an Aries. Trying to tap into your energy, Libra. Trying to figure out your money. Something is like surrounding your ability to gather resources, support, wealth. It's all about finances here. All we've seen is pentacles and major arcana. Who's trying to play in Libra's energy and why? Okay, you could definitely, for this to be showing itself for the third time now, you could have a Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo between the ages of 25 to 40. Playing in your energy. You have someone that feels like an equal. Like they've worked really hard too with the Knight of Pentacles. And then we have the Nine of Pentacles at the bottom. They're single, you're single. They appreciate your hustle. They appreciate your drive, Libra, whether you're feminine or masculine. I'm feeling like they're curious. I don't feel they're playing in your energy. I feel like they're curious about your energy because they see you in this nine of pentacles. Where it's like you just keep generating wealth and abundance. The Nine of Pentacles is a card of abundance. Being financially secure. Having it all within, mostly all, within yourself. Like being able to provide for yourself. Um, just... The Nine of Pentacles is that pre-Empress energy. They have it all going on. They're just single. Doesn't mean it's going to be that way forever. It means it's that way right now. For whoever I'm reading for in this Nine of Pentacles energy. Yeah, I just heard my God like it's a good place to be. It's a really good place to be. You're connected to spirit. Spirit is your connection to spirit. It it can't be stopped. It can't be tapped. 1444 on the clock. 1444. She's this bird is bringing in that pentacle to her and she's like 
reaching for it. Like, thanks, friend. Thanks, spirit. Good looking out. I appreciate the blessings. Love you back. Yes, that's the energy I get out of that card. Who else is trying to play in Libra's energy? Woo-wee! Up to five people and my nose is starting to twitch. We have a lot of water, a lot of fire, and we've seen a lot of pentacles. Five of Wands, these people are all trying to, it's a pull for power. They don't care who they step on though. Trying to reach higher levels. Like, look at this person. They're like stepping on their leg. It's like, are you kidding me? Five of Wands is really crabs in a bucket. You've got crabs in a bucket trying to play in your energy. Trying to reach the level that you, where you are going. <laughs> Can't make it up. They really want to reach that Nine of Pentacles right along with you, Libra. I'm hearing, but to each their own. They have their own journey, their own path. It cannot be exactly like Libra's. You can try all you want to figure out tips and tricks from trying to bring Libra down, but it's not going to work. It's Libra's connection to spirit that keeps you tapped into that abundant flow energy. When will they learn, Libra? Three shuffles. Energy Oracle. Ooh-wee! Deceit. People trying to bring you in fake offers. Keep an eye out, Libra. Yeah, door to romance behind that. I heard gaslighting. Trying to woo you. Third chakra, Archangel. Camuel, Chamuel. That's your solar plexus. That's your power chakra. Protect your chakras. Call back your power every night before bed. Call back all your power, Libra. Again, it's that sun energy, right? Yellow, that vibrancy. Your powerhouse, your power source. They're trying to drain your solar plexus. Drain your power. Who's trying to play in Libra's energy and why? Action. They want to stop you from taking action. But look. The white horse representing spirit and the... Can I say that? The white horse representing spirit and the black horse representing the physical life. And it's like you're, they hate that spirit seems to be leading your life. They don't want to believe it because they lack faith and belief in themselves with that action card and those two horses. Yeah, storm warning. They're too afraid. To follow their dreams because of either the storms that have occurred in their past or they're afraid of what might happen if they take action similar to the action you have taken, Libra, in your life. 
blossoming abundance. This is why, again, that Nine of Pentacles energy here. Truly tapped in, you are Libra. What a beautiful life. If you're not already living it, you're meant to live a beautiful life, Libra. Look at all this gold energy. Message, continue to take action, okay? Continue to allow spirit to lead your life and your path. And in doing so, you will continue to attract more and more abundance. Fourth chakra, leading with your heart, your heart chakra. A lot of green, a lot of yellow, okay? A lot of solar plexus, a lot of heart chakra. Who's trying to play? In Libra's energy and why thank you Archangel Michael for protecting myself and my Libra friends who call upon him the most powerful warrior angel is here Wow no wonder Archangel Michael just showed up the world I just heard the world is your oyster Libra Get ready to gobble it up. The world is your oyster. You could also have many different, again, at least five people. They could be from the same group, cult, coven, whatever you want to say or call it. Or these could be separate individuals who either are from different, even from different parts of the world. But Archangel Michael is here to remind you that you can call upon him anytime. You want to be, you feel the need, you need protection. You feel the need that you need protection. All right, shamanic medicine. People from your past are watching. Just cut to lower world, past. People that haven't elevated, they've stayed stuck in their own past or watching you <laughs> wealth, acquire all this wealth. Fire sign energy. They wish you, they had your passion. They wish they had your drive. Some people see you as fearless. You're not afraid, Libra. Immerse. Spirit is here to remind you to play. A lot more water energy, though, as well. So while they're trying to play in your energy... Spirit is gifting you the permission to actually embrace that lighthearted energy of true play, not fake play that actually is harm. It's not playing. It's, it's negative energy. It's lower life force look at that and as you do so and you embrace and you live again from your heart that light and love energy has permeated throughout this entire reading you know it has with all this golden light abundance and wealth and that green heart chakra energy in the Nine of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles and in the Tower. A lot of light, lightning, a lot of green transformation. You're the butterfly now. 
Libra is transformed. Beautiful. You're so blessed. You're blessed, Libra. Let's read Sea Creatures and Offerings. Take a deep breath and dive right in. Sea Creatures has been waiting to help you discover the inner riches that lay dormant, deep within you. Whatever is contained must be released. Once you accept your limits, you're able to go beyond them. This water totem is bright, playful, and has swum by to remind you to follow its example. Live without limits. You are being encouraged to immerse yourself in whatever you are currently working on. Become fully involved and put your heart and soul into accomplishing your goals. There are endless, endless resources all around you. Sea Creatures helps you identify. I didn't I say that it was your resources and your hustle, your drive, your heart. That's why people want to play in your energy, Libra. There are endless resources all around you. Sea Creatures helps you identify any deep emotions that need to be set free. By observing their patterns, Sea Creatures teaches you to loosen up. The waters of the ocean represent freedom and mobility. The fascinating creatures of the oceanic realms have been honored and revered since ancient times. It is time for you to do the same. Take the plunge and put the fun back into everything you do. Go with the flow. Everything is working out as it should. Put your focus on your dreams. Take action. You will be doing what you love. Immerse yourself in all that truly makes your heart sing. Play, Libra. And offerings would like to tell you that financial difficulties are soon resolved. An unexpected windfall comes your way. Focus on what you do want rather than what you do not. You are worthy. Practice the art of receiving, Libra. Gratitude ensures a bountiful crop. Give thanks and offer up with love. Ensure abundance from above. With humble heart, you must believe. Hold your hands out to receive. Oh my gosh, Libra, I cannot make this up. Look what's behind wealth. It says offerings, wealth, south, abundance. Oh my gosh, an amplification behind that. Wow, I could be talking to like earth warriors, nature lovers, people that are going to do really good things out in the world. With all this incoming, blossoming abundance and amplification of your wealth, riches, and abundance, Libra. Holy moly. It's like I just heard you hit the jackpot. This is it. The moment you've been waiting for. This is it. This is so amazing. This is so amazing. Before we close out this reading, one shuffle, message for Libra. People trying to play in your energy, you could know them personally, okay? Message for Libra. Message for Libra. Thank you, Spirit. Wow, the power of love, your heart chakra. Drive forward transmute it fuel your fire power on so use all that 
crap that they're trying to throw at you or play in your energy. Use it to fuel your own fire and go towards your dreams. Drive forward. Power on. And look what it came out with. It's really, it's like, spirit's like, continue to take action, Libra. Continue to take action towards your dreams. Okay? Travel, go, freedom, movement. Maybe some of you are getting ready to travel. You may know this and you may not. It might be a surprise. Oh my gosh, houseway. We started this reading off talking about you lead your life with light and love. Libra, you literally got two cards that say light and the power of love. Spirit is here. Double, triple, quadruple confirmation. Whoa. The light at the bottom it says light bulb moment positive vibes good energy with the power of love wow 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 let's close out this reading with a little divine melody okay I'm going to count back from three. Once I get to one, I want you to breathe in your nose and then exhale out of your mouth whenever you're ready. Exhale all of that stress away, Libra, and breathe in all the good vibes, okay? Three, two, one. That was so nice, Libra. Did you see the cricket, like cricket or frog in the background? <laughs> Chimed in as soon as I did the chimes. That was cool. If you enjoyed this reading, give me a big thumbs up so I can reach more Librans. Thank you all so, so much from the bottom of my heart chakra for all your love and light and support every day in all ways. Stay balanced. Stay blessed, Libra. Until the next one. Peace.